Hi guys, um, we're going to go over a question about derivatives. And the first question asks why we need um, to tell to be bigger than equal to r m n of 0. Well, we need that to happen, otherwise our dm over dt is positive, so we're not paying off the mortgage. So we need tau to be bigger than r m 0 to be paying off the mortgage. So for the second part, um, we need to find m in terms of t. So we start with the, equa the differential equation dm over dt equals rm minus tau. And we use separation variables to bring all the function m on one side, become 1 over um, rm over t, then 1 on the other side. We integrate the left-hand side, we get 1 over t log of tau minus rm. And the right hand side is t plus the integration constant c. So we can rearrange the equation and obtain, um, through some working, obtain m equals t minus a times e to the rt over r. So that's our function for m. Now we need to use the initial variable to find the parameter a. So at t equals 0, we have m of 0 equals tau minus a e to the r0 over r. And we can rearrange this equation to solve a in terms of m0. So in this case, a equals t minus r m0 over, and that's it. And we can put this a into our original um, equation. So m equals t minus bracket tau minus r m zero times e to the r t all over r. So that's our general equation. And for part three, we have to ask us how long does it take to pay off the mortgage? In this case, what's the time t when m t equals zero? Well, in this case, we have t minus, t minus that over r equals um, 0. So we have r minus, so we can do some rearrangement to obtain our t equals um, that. So, that, so that's the time it takes to pay off our mortgage. For part four, they give us some specific numbers for interest rate and the total mortgage payment and yearly payment, and we have to figure out the time taken. This is done by just substituting all the parameters into our last calculated equation. And in this case, the equation is this. So from here, um, we are going to use a calculator to first calculate what's inside the log. So it's 24,000 divided by 24,000 minus 0 0.05 times 400,000, which is 6. So we can, we're going to put that into the log. So that's become 6 and log of 6 here. And using our calculator again, taking the log of 6, and then divide by 0 0.05, which gave us 35.8 years. Just be sure, yep. Mm -hmm. So that's how long it takes to pay off the mortgage. Then the question asks us, how much would we pay all together? Well, if every year we pay 24,000, then the total amount, it will just be 24,000 times the amount of year, which is 35.8. So going back to our calculator again, we times the year number by 24,000, which gave us eight, 860 
$1,044. And that's all. Uh, thank you for watching and remember to subscribe.